A bulldozer roared outside Jim Bob Brookheiser's tent Monday morning as he yanked on an extension cord caught in a tangle of his belongings. Half a dozen veterans in the Veterans Row homeless encampment along San Vicente Boulevard scrambled to get their possessions into bins and onto moving vans driven by volunteers. Tensions were high on moving day at the encampment, which sits along the perimeter of the historic Veterans Affairs campus near Brentwood. Roughly 4, 000 veterans in the county are homeless, and about 40 have been living at the Veterans Row encampment for the last several months. The effort was the byproduct of several months of outreach to the homeless veterans community, said Robert Reynolds, an advocate with AMVETS, the Veterans Service Organization. Advocates say they have been meeting with veterans on the street to prepare them to leave the encampment and move into a temporary tent village on the VA campus itself. The process could be jarring. You get a veteran inside, another one shows up, Reynolds said. A lack of resources offered by the Federal Department of Veterans Affairs has led to a steady increase in the homeless veterans population, he said, leading to the encampment outside the campus. The VA intends to move the veterans into a tiny home village on the campus once it is completed. Several tiny homes are already occupied by veterans, but dozens more need to be set up. It's infuriating and heartbreaking, because for so long these veterans were forgotten, said Diego Garcia, an outreach volunteer and Army veteran working with MVETS. Last month, you. As Veterans Affairs Secretary Dennis McDonough promised to find housing for the veterans from the encampment by the beginning of this month, and for 500 other homeless veterans by the end of the year. I think one of the things we are really trying to do is focus on concentrated outreact. We're trying to understand that sometimes folks have to be treated as comrades, as part of a community, and try to keep people comfortable as they're making the transition and working with them.